Tiny Dog here with a tiny tip for farming gravitino balls or albumin pearls for big money in No Man's Sky. This probably applies to other rare resources as well, but these two are the only rare resources I've encountered so far in 67 hours of gameplay, although I am taking the game at a measured pace. Gravitino balls and albumin pearls are both worth 27,500 units each, which makes them very profitable to farm. The main drawback is that neither of them stack, so you'll quickly run out of inventory space and you'll have to visit a sales terminal frequently. There is actually a workaround, or game exploit, that allows you to stack these items, but I'll cover that in another video. In my case, I found both Gravitino Balls and Albumen Pearls on my fourth solar system, on a barren moon where the first Atlas monolith was located. The moon had an extreme sentinel environment, which just means that the sentinels are aggressive and hostile. Because it's considered an extreme environment, you get journey milestones for simply standing around outside, even though there was no harsh weather to contend with. These planetary characteristics might not apply to all planets on which there are gravitino balls or albumin pearls, but this is where I found them. When you use your scanner, rare resources appear with a green exclamation mark icon. Gravitino balls look like shiny red spheres that light up brightly when you approach them. Be aware that a nearby sentinel might come to investigate once a gravitino ball lights up. As soon as you pick up the gravitino ball, a robotic laser dog and two sentinels will materialize and attack you. You can fight them, hide, or just keep running and grabbing more balls. If you do fight them, you'll often get a dimensional matrix from the laser dog which is worth 15,125 units. However, since the Gravitino Balls and Albumen Pearls are worth a lot more, you'll probably want to discard the Dimensional Matrices and the Neutrino Modules that the Sentinels drop. If you've already learned all of the blueprints that Sentinels can give you, then you can just ignore the Sentinel loot altogether. Albumen Pearls are contained inside these alien seed pod things like in the movies. They kind of look like a reddish pumpkin with no stem. When you approach the pod, its title will say, Unknown. Press the interact button and it will open up to reveal the albumen pearl, which you can then take. Just like with gravitino balls, as soon as you touch the albumen pearl you'll get attacked by a laser dog and two sentinels. Once your inventory fills up with balls or pearls, just head to the nearest sales terminal or trader to sell them. If the sales kiosk doesn't offer a very good price, you can always move on to the next, or wait until another trader ship lands if there's a landing platform. If you want an even better price, then you can head up to the space station and see if the sales kiosk or one of the trader ships there will give you plus 90 to plus 100 percent price. However, traveling to the space station and hunting for a good deal can be pretty time consuming, so you may want to simply stay planet side and harvest more resources. You can expect to make upwards of 800 or 900 thousand units from a single load. Like I mentioned earlier, there is a trick that lets you stack items that are normally unstackable like gravitino balls or albumen pearls, but I can cover that in another video. Furthermore, it's a glitch that will probably be patched pretty soon. That's it. Thanks for watching, and happy farming.